Good morning children. Welcome back to class 3 English Grammar Worksheet 2 Reading Sub Skills Read this newspaper article and find out the names of three trains from the article. The name of the article is The Morning Daily. Three new trains to be launched in February. New Delhi Three new trains will be launched next month for three different routes in the country. All the three new trains will have been introduced to give better services to passengers. The Anantha Express will travel from Guwati Junction to Seldha Junction thrice a week. The train will stop only at two stations, Rampur Hat and Burdwan. The Uttar Express will travel from Katagodam Junction to Chandigarh Junction four times a week. It will stop only at one station, Ambala. The Jamunai Express will travel from Tirpur Junction to Nagpur Junction twice a week without stopping anywhere. All the three trains will have pantries that will be used to serve and sell hot cold meals and drinks to the passengers. Special services will also be available for children and elderly people. Now, what do you think launched means? Launched means started. What do you think pantries? Pantries are the rooms in trains used for storing food and drinks for the passengers. Now, look into the names here. Ananta Express is a train and Uttar Express and Jamunai Express. Underline those three names of the trains. Tick the correct answers to complete these sentences. Already we have read the paragraph. Now what are we going to do? Looking into the paragraph, we will answer the questions which is given to us. The name of the newspaper is, what is the name of the newspaper? The Evening Daily, The Daily Mail, The Morning Daily. It is The Morning Daily. The newspaper article is about all the new trains which will be launched in the year. Three new trains which will be launched in the month of February. Three new trains which will be launched in the present month. So it is B. It, three new trains which will be launched in the month of February. The Uttar Express will travel from Kathagodam Junction to Chandigarh Junction and stop at one station. Guwati Junction to Selda Junction and stop at two stations. Tirpur Junction to Nagpur Junction without stopping anywhere. So what is the answer? It is Kathagodam Junction to Chandigarh Junction and stop at once. The train which will not stop at any station is the Ananta Express, the Uttar Express, the Jamunai Express. It is the Jamunai Express. The three trains will have hot or cold meals and drinks for children, pantry services and other special services for children and elderly people. Special services for elderly People. It is pantry services for other special services for the children and for the elderly people. Next is grammar and words. We always use A before a consonant sound or a singular noun. So here a tortoise, a cycle. We always use an before a vowel sound or a singular noun. It is an onion an igloo. Use the before. When are we going to use this word the? It is consonant and vowel sound. We are going to use it before the both. Either the film is very interesting or names of things which we know. The earth moves around the sun. It is the earth and the sun. When it is only one thing, when you are going to mention a thing which is only one. So, earth, the sun. So, we are using the before the consonant and both the vowel sounds. But names of the things which we know and only one thing to mention also. Complete this paragraph with a, an or the. 
Here A is used when the consonant sounds come. An is used with the vowels. Here the is used with both consonants and with the vowels. Now let us check in and fill the blanks children. Once upon a time there was a group of girls and boys in dash town. Because town is a town, a small town, only one mention. They played in a music band. People always invited them to play at birthdays or important events in the town. Now here the town. Here yes is a consonant. So we have used a. Here town is a proper place. What is mentioned? A, you can't use a. You have to in the eve, town. So here the is used. There was only one problem that was Kevin. Kevin was dash important member. So here I is there. So what we should use? We have to use an because I is a vowel. An important member of dash of the of the band. But he was always late. Once, dash boys and girls are invited. So, once the, now both are there, boys and girls are invited to play at dash exhibition. E is a vowel sound. So, here it will be an exhibition. It was dash very big. It was a here, V is a consonant, big event and they did not want to be late. So, they reached Kevin's house, dash R before. Now, it is an R. Now, an, it's H is there. But why it is, why are we going to use an children now? When you spell the word, H will be silent, you can hear only R. So, when the sound changes also, what will happen? The articles what you write also should be changed. Not only looking into the first letter you will change, you will also listen to the sounds and then you will change. So, here an R. R means O sound is there. O is a vowel. H here is a consonant but the sound which it comes out is R. So, what do we do? We will use an R. Before the exhibition began. Before the exhibition began. Things that can be counted, countable. Cannot be counted, uncountable. So, here, countable nouns and uncountable nouns. When are we going to use this countable nouns and uncountable nouns? We use many, some, any before countable nouns. Examples are given for us. I have many crayons. I have some crayons. I don't have any crayons. Where you can use many, some and any before the nouns which can be counted. Crayons can be counted. So, in front of crayons or in front of pencils, the things which you can count, in front of those you can use many, some and any words and next when you are when are we going to use this uncountable nouns that is when we are writing much some any a little these words are used before uncountable nouns see we don't have much time time can't be counted so in front of that much time we have some time we don't have any time we have a little time so this is how you use the words for the countable nouns and for the uncountable nouns. Circle the countable nouns and underline the uncountable nouns in this box. What are we supposed to do? Look into the box children. Few words are given here. Few are the countable nouns and few are uncountable nouns. We are going to circle the countable nouns and underline the uncountable nouns. So here, basket, it's already circled. Count. Coffee, can you count coffee children? 
नो इट इज इन अनकाउंटेबल नाउ सो वी विल अंडरलाइन इट किटन येस वी कैन काउंट इट इज अकाउंटेबल नाउ बनाना येस बनाना वी कैन काउंट लव कैन यू काउंट दिस नो हिल कैन यू काउंट दिस येस म्यूजिक नो कैन यू काउंट ऑयल नो कैन यू काउंट पॉलिश नो कैन यू काउंट बैंगल येस कैन यू काउंट स्नो नो कैन यू काउंट टेबल येस सो नाउ द सर्कल लेटर्स आर काउंटेबल नाउन्स एंड द अंडरलाइन लेटर्स आर अनकाउंटेबल नाउन्स कंप्लीट दीज सेंटेंसेस विथ सम मेनी मच अ लिटिल और एनी सो हियर यू हैव टू फिल द ब्लैंक्स विथ द वर्ड्स विच इज गिवन टू यू एंड विच इज सुटेबल the cake needs just dash bit of sugar so here you cannot count sugar so what will you write a little bit of so what will we write a little bit of sugar would you like to listen dash music now music you can't count so it is would you like to listen some music there isn't dash food left there isn't any any food left should we order dash should we order some more or some there are so dash books on the shelf there are so many books because you can count you are using many on the shelf you can take any you can take any because there are many books you can't count you'll make them any here any of them complete the sentences with the opposites of the words in color then complete the crossword with the opposites so here across words are given down words are given once you fill the blanks here what you have to do is you have to complete the crossword puzzle which is given to you here so here day what is the opposite of day children i hope it is night so you will write night outside inside close open tall short strong weak full empty next one is downwards the fat fat means thin above below hard soft add subtract subtract my younger brother knows to add add is given opposite of add is subtract and here it is cool it is very hot outside over under so we have completed the fill in the blanks now what should we do is we have to fill the crossword puzzle here one question number 1 the answer of question number 1 is night n i g h t night question number Two. What is the answer of question number two, children? It is thin, t h i n, thin. And now, what is the answer of question number three? Question number three is below, b e l o w. What is the question answer for question number four? It is soft, s o f t, soft. What is the question number? Five, five outside. It is inside. Is the answer okay? Seventh question number seven. Open. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन शॉर्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स इज सब्रैक्ट सब्रैक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर एट इट इज वॉम डब्ल्यू ए आर एम क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन इज वीक डब्ल्यू ई ए के क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन इज अंडर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व इज एम टी सो दिस इज अ वे हाव यू आर फिलिंग द और कंप्लीटिंग द क्रॉसवर्ड टेबल जस्ट चेक इन द आंसर्स here 8 1 it is very hot we wrote it's not hot it is warm outside but the room is nice and cool punctuation we always use capital letters when are we going to use these capital letters one is to begin a sentence when we begin a sentence what we do we start from capital letter to begin a proper noun proper noun is a name of a person place or thing so what we do we start the word with a capital letter when we mention i in a sentence when i is mentioned alone in the sentence you will use it as capital letter so whenever we begin with the sentence see we are writing capital and we will write they they are going to the zoo means t will be capital Here, Sonal and I play badminton every day. Sonal is the name of the person, and also it is the beginning of a sentence. What do we do? We will write this as capital, and I is used as alone, and it is I will be written in capital letter. Now let us see. Underline the words that should begin with capital letters. So here, I hope the first letter when we begin a sentence, what should we do? We have to. write o capital and march is the name of the month it will be capital i is capital semily semly the name of the river is capital i again is capital it i capital there t capital zeba capital t capital so these are the words which should be in capital letters which should begin with capital letters next it is a writing work for you children if you are interested you can look into the picture here look at this picture of a railway station and describe the scene in paragraph so looking into the railway station picture you have to write few lines about it try and answer these questions when you write see what place is this you have to write it it is a railway station who are the people in the picture which characters can come across in the picture you have to see to the characters and you have to then write the people who come across why are they here why are they in the railway station you need to give an explanation for that what are they doing and what are the people they are doing there in the railway station so if you are interested you can complete this and write it as a paragraph newspapers have a very long history in india work in pairs and find out some interesting fact about india's first newspaper work together and find out so you have to take the help of your teacher or your elders i have done it for you for this time children from next time onwards it should be done by yourself you can go to the website and you can search in the internet you can search and then you can find the facts now first name of the first newspaper is bengal gazette the year it was published 1780 name of the person who published it james augustus hickey the price it was sold at rupees 1 for how long was it published for 2 years hope all have understood children please do your work neatly without any mistakes do it in pencil thank you